I'm Jackie McWilliams, Commissioner of the Central Intercollegiate Athletic Association, CIAA. My love of sports came from, I believe my mother. And I think my mom was uh, always wanted to keep me active. She allowed me to, to play and compete at a very early age. And I didn't know it would lead up to me loving to play basketball and volleyball and running track in high school and then using that as an opportunity to play in college. So I begged my parents to let me go to Hampton and that I would work hard to get a scholarship. And if I did it, then I would have to come home. And I got a scholarship after my freshman year and we won the national championship, Division II Women's NCAA Championship. I could compete and that didn't matter that I was a black girl. I was just a good athlete. And so I never had to justify my being on the court. And so it just gave me an opportunity to play the game freely and get my education and be supported in a way that every girl and boy wants to be supported when they go to college or just grow up. And it just felt different to be a part of that family for me. So I absolutely believe that Hampton University helped me develop and gain a confidence that I'm not sure I completely had before I got there. But then I got a call from Dr. Thomas. He's the commissioner at the MEAC. The athletic director at Virginia Union is really interested in you coming to coach. And so I took it. And James Battle was the athletic director. He taught me how to be fair in the business. He taught me how to be compassionate. He taught me how to use my voice. <laughs> I was 23, <laughs> coaching. Coaching young women who were 18 and 17, so I matured very quickly. You know, the roles that I've had, I've always been the example and the leader to be around the people, good and bad, that have challenged me personally and professionally, um, and to learn how to lead other people in the way that Coach Battle led me. I think we have a responsibility in sport to change lives. We get the opportunity to create experiences, give access and opportunity to every single individual if we're open enough to allow that. So you have the privilege to play, but you also have responsibility to give back and to help those who cannot help themselves, to help the voiceless have voices, um, and also to entertain. I think I'm in a position or role, and even with my team, I always tell them we're ambassadors of sports, we're ambassadors for the CIAA, and we need to teach our student athletes the same through our Student Athlete Advisory Committee. And when we talk to them, we're not talking at them, we're talking with them. We're engaging them so that they can go tell the stories and they can engage other students and other athletes to be a part of what we get to do every single day. But the best part of being commissioner is that I get to influence and make change. It means I have a platform. I have a platform to use my voice and to serve others. I have position. I have a position to put others in position and to speak in roles of position for others where numbers are low and where there needs to be change. I'm planting seeds for young people. I'm planting seeds for my daughter. I'm planting seeds for my staff. I want them to be prepared to be the next. I get to help them have a voice. That's why I love Commissioner, because I, I let people have voices when they don't always have it. And I always ask students, what's your mission? Where did, where's your end goal? Like, what are you doing this for? Because I know who I serve and what I get to serve for, which helps my days be better. Because if it's about me, then we're gonna have some rough days, right? But when it's about what I know, what my purpose and the service of this conference and what it means to the world, to this region and to these 12 member institutions, it's passion work. I feel so blessed. <laughs>